Here at Maven, we like things easy. And we found something that's easier than pie. So easy, you've already done it before, you already know how to use it, but we're gonna introduce you to it today. These are distribution connectors. They're like a little bust hub. There are multiple options. We've got a six, eight, and a 12 pin. You're used to seeing a connector that goes together. You've got wires coming out of each side. This one is already terminated. You see pins in there. When you flip it over, you will see a block all the way around this connector. That identifies that all of these pins are connected together. If you put a pin of 12 volt power on there, 16 volt power, whatever it is, all the pins have that. Another option, in a similar way, has two different sides. This side, all the pins on this side are connected to each other. This side, this side is connected to each other, but this side is not connected to this side. You could have a ground on one side, like a sensor ground and a sensor power on one side, and then feed this to multiple other locations. This other 12 pin, as you can see, yeah, you guessed it, it's got three separate buses or connectors on it. So we, here we've got um, the six pin all connected and then um, an all connected and a, a split uh, eight pin. This comes with everything you need to do the job. You've got your wedge lock that you're gonna put in after you put your sockets in. You don't need the pins because they're already involved and, and captured here in the connector. You're gonna crimp and terminate your wires the same way you do on your DT or AT style connectors, um, your wedge lock, and then this here connector, this clip is actually goes on, and you could screw this to, let's say a firewall, you can screw it to whatever you want, and then this will slide in and clip in. Keep your connector in the right place. Uh, we'll, th we'll throw up a picture here. You can see that there's multiple uses for this. You can see a CAN bus is being used, uh, sensor and power ground, uh, different power distributions for different features, let's say wideband controllers. Uh, really, there's nothing holding you back from using it for whatever makes sense. That's why we like it. It keeps things clean. You can easily clip them out of the way, uh, uh, you know, clip them and keep everything out of the way um, in a, a nice tight spot. And there's just really a lot of uses for it. It's handy to have with the different options. Uh, so again, the kit comes with both sides of the connector, the wedge lock, a clip, so that you have a way to, to hold the connector if you'd like to. It can just stay in a harness like you would in anything else. Um, but you can use that clip to, to, uh, to keep it where you want. Here's a diagram of all the different options here. Um, this, this makes it clear which one is which and you know, pick whatever suits your application. Again, it doesn't matter what you're running through it. It can be power, ground, CAN bus. It can be um, you know, five volt reference. Just a lot of different options here uh, and very easy. Again, this makes our life easier when you're wiring something to keep it clean, keep it simple. And we'll put a link in the description below. Check them out, grab a few, have a few extra in your toolbox. Check them out, let us know if you have any questions, give us a call, send us an email. Thanks.